Is Dr. Burke alive? Yes. Shame. He'd have probably have made a good donor. Okay, people, let's get our organs and get out of here. Okay, that heart is not yours yet. Seattle Grace is still waiting for test results. Well, I'm not. Ten blade. Can't do that. I just did. Sir, uh, I need to ask you a hypothetical question. Can we do this another time? Uh, if someone on the staff deliberately unhooked a transplant candidate from his LVAD in an attempt to worsen his condition and get him moved up the donor list, hypothetically, sir. I think you need to tell me exactly what's going on here, doctor. Believe me, sir, you want this to stay a hypothetical because I'm thinking if something like that did happen, you'd be duty-bound to report it and the hospital would be in danger of losing its accreditation as a transplant site. So hypothetically... Hypothetically, if the patient got worse, would it be unethical for him to receive the heart, even though medically his worsened condition now puts him at the top of the donor list? Hypothetically. How bad is he? In the few hours it would take a new LVAD to be delivered, he'll be dead. Our responsibility is to the patient. If medically he's at the top of the list, then he should get the heart. Hypothetically. Thank you, sir. But practically, whoever removed the patient from the LVAD, I expect to be given names, and there will be severe, severe consequences. Yes, sir. So I'm gonna try to get Wait, hold on. Dr. Hahn. Dr. Hahn. Can't stop now, Karev. I only have a few hours to get this heart into my guy. Dr. Hahn. Yunos gave the heart to Seattle Grace. The transplant coordinator already called and stopped your guy from being prepped. Oh, come on. He has kids. They're four and five. Do you know how long he's been waiting for this? He's a good person. He deserves a heart. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll bet you are. No, I am. Believe me. Listen. We have a chopper waiting on the roof. And? I hope you figure it out. It's a